What's up boys, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you guys how to download a soundboard for Rust or any other game or you can also have a voice generator or voice changer. So the first thing you want to do, go to this website. I'll have it down in the description, first link. And then the second thing you want to do is press download. It, it, the only way you can download is if you have seven, Windows 7, 8, 8.1, and 10, 64-bit. There's probably a 32-bit out there. If I find it, I'll link it down in the description below. Um, but yeah, check down there first before you download the 64-bit just in case. Because if, if you don't have 64-bit, it's going to mess it up. So make sure you have 64-bit. If not, if there's not a 32-bit, I'm sorry. I'll try to find one. If it updates, I'll get one in the description as soon as possible. But for right now, there's only a 64-bit that I found. But yeah, so let me uh, show you how it works. After you download it, it's going to bring up two pictures. It's going to ask for your main microphone and your main output device. So make sure you put those both as what they are. And after you do that, it's going to show you exactly how to use it in-game, but I'll show you as well. It's pretty simple. So for Rust, it's pretty simple as well So because you don't actually have like an option in the settings for your audio device. So I'll show you how to do that. But when you load it up, it should say this. Every day, there's new th ones in here. I mean, these things aren't that good, but we're not worried about that. We're worried about the soundboard. So first thing you want to do is add new sound. I already have two sounds here as examples. Got the Rust C4 and the Fortnite Death Sound. I already have the Rust C4 in, and we'll put uh, this will be the oh this will be the E for the Fortnite Death Sound. So after you get your keys and your sound in, um, to download sounds, I just go on YouTube, right? Doesn't matter what you search up, you can search up C4 sound, and then I use this one. You just you just download it, and then go to YouTube to MP3. And then go there, put the link in, and download it. That's the easiest way. It will make it a sound file instead of a video file. You do that, then um, you put, go here, press add new sound. It should be in your downloads or on this PC, doesn't matter. Click that, make a uh, keybind, and now I'm gonna bring you guys into Ross and I'll show you guys exactly how to use it. All right, boys, before you go into Ross, one more thing. You gotta make sure your input device is on the microphone it provides whenever you download it. If it's not on that, Ross will not take it and will let it work because it is not. Russ doesn't have its own audio option, so make sure it's on that. It's pretty easy to get here. If you just look on the bottom right, click this, and then go to option sound settings. It'll take you right to it. Um, and yeah, let me go into Rust and show you guys how to use it. So you want to come in. Make sure whenever you want to play the sound, make sure you're not running around or holding any other key down on the keyboard. Or it won't work. But as soon as you are ready to use the sound, you just click the key line and turn your mic on. And it'll work perfectly fine. And to stop the commands, you want to do Control Shift S. It'll stop every single command or any sound that's playing at that time. And I, I don't know if you can play multiple sounds. Let me test. I, you might be able to play multiple sounds at once. No, you can only play one sound at once, but it cancels out the sounds basically. So yeah, that's how you use it. Um, if I can get some funny clips of me using it, I'll put them in after this. But that's basically it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you guys did enjoy. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'm also streaming, I stream on Twitch about almost every day, uh, playing Fortnite. And I'm probably going to start putting some Rust into there and mixing it up a little bit. But yeah, if you guys want to join me on Fortnite, watching me stream, anything, the links will be down in the description. But yeah, make sure to follow me on Twitch if you want to. And yeah, just like the video if it helped you out. Put uh, questions down below if you need help with anything. And I'll try to reply to as many as possible. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.